Oh no. Uh. Oh. No. Um, when the results for the oil will be calculated or finished? We're hoping to announce it around 3.30. Alright. Look at this. I know I'm right. I'm 
Alrighty, we just we go with the walk around to the bait truck. Draw that. That bait truck. The monster truck. Hit him. Make sure you don't hit for himself. They've been down to that house, and the mother, I mean, you know, guys, when you, when you have a child of his age, and he needs correct heart surgery to live, the brother, that's a serious thing. I think what, what you all saw was him coming out of his shell once he got well, and, and really was able to be a young boy like you want a young boy to be, healthy and running around and inquisitive and a little bit of a troublemaker and everything. Yeah, well, that's exactly what Sean is like because we went to the house on Montreal Avenue and the mother said, boy, Mr. Folks, I don't know, y'all give my boy a new heart. And in, in fact, he went to Joe DiMaggio uh, Children's um, Hospital, is that correct? Yes, yes, in North Miami, yes. Right, and let me tell you, ladies and gentlemen, so what you're going out here is a Bruce Pimpany moment. Just trying to have one heart at a time. Exactly, and, and through the year we can always, your donations are always welcome. But for us, this is the kind of event that we count on to help us meet the demand because every year our numbers of kids we're having to help is growing. And so we're counting the public support and people like the and people on the club to come through for us. It really does make a profound difference in helping us be able to never say no to a child again. And who knows, that was Sean Fox. I mean, guys, I'm, I'm not, you know, you almost did it. Women is a when you see that boy, boy, he was lethargic. He had no ups, he had no nothing. When we went to Montreal Avenue, and saw that little boy jumping up and down, I said, I got a lot of good. I see them on all the time. I don't think I'm going to see them still going to come up. Everything about that is if you know what you're talking about, you're talking about the name of the barn. When you know what you're talking about, you know you're slugging in that second year. Boy, when you can feel better, put that in two, and go in four, and go in fifth, and six. Now you know you're talking about a hard on child is going to name it. And once again, thank you everyone for your support. All right. 